Good morning, viewers. So uh, we are back at it, back at it again. So uh, as you see, we are in a beautiful setup in uh, Lake District. So we are in a place called uh, Keswick, uh, and uh, this time we are going to do uh, the Skidaw Track. So it's about nine miles uh, hike up the Lake District uh, mountains. So as you might be aware of the setup here, so that's the beautiful discovery sport and uh, that's our tent setup for today and uh, we are just we're at a place called uh, bridge bridge end campsite so this is in the middle of keswick so uh, yeah let's see we are just woke up uh, time for some breakfast coffee and then possibly the rain has just stopped so the weather seems to be a bit uh, uh, a bit more damp so hopefully we should be able to get on our way pretty soon after breakfast so come along and let's see how we um, how we tackle this mountain then. So we are now at the parking spot where we are all getting ready, wearing our gaiters because the weather seems to be a bit uh, overcast. So hopefully we should be in a good spot. We should have some dry spells. Let's see. As you see, we're all wearing gaiters, getting a crash course from Sham. <laughs> so the missing case of one gator is sold. <laughs> so, as you see, all ready, all set. So our uh, next update is when we start hiking. Okay, finally the hike has begun. After solving the case of <laughs> Mystery gators. <laughs> Mystery gators. <laughs> Missing gators. Missing gators. So uh, this is going to be about a nine mile hike. Uh, the time is now about near about 11, 10 minutes to 11. So let's see, um, it should take about six to eight hours, provided the weather is uh, good. But if you see there, you can see it's really the clouds are coming down so we got our waterproofs and everything ready so let's see how it goes okay see you until next update Just spectacular. Slightly drizzling, damp, but hopefully it should be okay. The fall colors are just amazing. Just wanted to uh, show the sheer beauty of colors that you see during uh, autumn each color is so bright and it's just so mesmerizing to just walk through them it's just a beautiful day okay so yeah we're on our way just had a very steep hill climb but I think there are more upgrade incoming but uh, yeah it seems good it seems a good day for now you can see a big dark cloud coming our way but 
hopefully we should clear soon so yeah see you until the next update Another update. Just on our way to uh, Skida, and if you look at the front, that's our path, which goes zigzag. There's two paths: one the zigzag way on the right, and one which is a straight path up to the mountain into the house. We are at about 330 meters yeah. before we start the climb and I, I believe that goes all the way to about 800 meters so yeah wish us luck I think the plan is to get the kids over in the summer to do this uh, activity it's pretty straightforward and, um, you for the next update okay as you see we're still debating which way to go uh, half of the team they want to go uh, in the straight route and I want to follow the zigzag because I jammed my uh, my ties the other night so I don't want to jam it again so yeah it's all the same route but on either direction. Then deciding how to jump the barbed wire. <laughs> okay, let's go. Okay, another update. Banana stop. <laughs> Banana stop. As you see, the weather has changed. So it's gone more from uh, it's freezing cold. So our waterproofs are up. Hopefully it should get better by the time we uh, reach to the top. How do you feel? Still. But the weather still seems to be okay. Yeah. We can survive. We've seen much worse much days worse. <laughs> than what we have but, seen. But glad at least it's not raining. Yeah. It's just a bit uh, chilly. Okay. See you until the next update. Another 400 more to go. <laughs> See you here. So, as we continue our journey after the uh, pit stop for some waterproofs and some energy bars, we still got another 500 meters to go. As you see, the ascent is still continuous compared to where we started. Around right there. Rain has set in, it's kind of drizzling, and uh, as you see, the path is up and up and up, going all the way till currently at about 400 meters, and the altitude we need to hit is about 800 900 meters, so another 500 more to go. As you see, path. on about 600 uh, meters or 650 meters so it's another 200 250 more okay well uh, see you soon
walking 8.42 kilometers. Finally, the ticket off. Now if you look, the weather has, just after we came down, the weather has improved so much that uh, not raining is cold, but it's better. But uh, yeah, it was an amazing experience to walk all the way up. It took about three and a half hours to walk about eight, eight to ten kilometers up to reach uh, Kidao. So yeah, I think another couple of hours we should be back now. Until then, I think the Singa beer can't be made. This is a must right there. Yeah. Yeah, so on the lunch, yeah, we are going planning to grab it after we go down because uh, we never know when the rain will uh, start again. Banana, but banana, banana, peach, <laughs> that's keeping us going. And actually, that is, I think we need to make it a point that every hike or any hiker who sees this video it's very important that you have dates and bananas in your backpack because it gives instant energy whenever you experience any cramp in your legs or in your calf muscles any any other tip you want to give Duraka? No, that's in my orange they have orange, orange. Yeah, orange dates and bananas so that's coming from an experienced hiker who has done Himalayas and all the all, all the ex most of the <laughs> most of the yeah, yeah he's, he's a very experienced hiker. So if you want any tips, I'm sure Divakar will give uh, further in the video. Yeah. Okay. Until then, see you in the next uh, update. I just want to show you how beautiful that part is. Uh, has brought out all the colors you can. And the clouds are passing by us. It's just beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Okay, until then. Okay, and we have done it back down so it's nearly 17 kilometers of hike amazing very good last hike of the last hike last of the hike. year stay over hike, yeah? yeah so it was fantastic weather was very unkind but then <laughs> when we came down it was full of sunshine so that helped but anyway thank you amazing and let's get back to the car and eat some food Jai Jintana. Jai Jintana. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Bye. Okay, all ready to leave uh, the bridge end camp. The camp has been successful. 
worked really well. And uh, the weather oh, has <laughs> Yay! Sham! <laughs> yeah, so the weather has been fantastic. So, as, as you see, the weather has uh, been better and we have been able to successfully de camp and uh, heading back home. Another three, three and a half hours. Yeah. See, you, see you in commentary. Bye. 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 Happy New Year and see you until the next uh, hike.